For the second in as many nights and the second of our four days of same-day coverage on TBS, we come to you from the Sports and Concert Complex. It's a multi-purpose facility about a half an hour's drive from the heart of St. Petersburg, Russia. Good evening once again, everybody. I'm Vern Lundquist. Welcome to Russia. Welcome to our same-day coverage of Centennial on Ice. And a fascinating night for you this evening. We've got the ladies' short program. That means a head-to-head -head battle against Michelle Kwan and Nicole Bobek of the United States. And we'll determine a pair's champion. We had some interesting things happen yesterday and today. You might have been with us last night when Rudy Galindo, the men's champion, competed here in the short program, then was forced to withdraw because of a rather severe ankle injury. Well, Ingo Steuer and Mandy Wurzel of Germany had the lead after the pair short program. And this afternoon, they had to withdraw. I'm joined by Peter Carruthers, who won a silver medal in pairs in 1984. Tough, tough deal for Stoyer and Wurzel. Well, it's so disappointing to hear that they have had to withdraw. But during the short program, Ingo Stoyer really had a bad back injury. It happened on this particular element, the split double twist lift. Everything looks fine right here. However, it was on that lift that he experienced tremendous pain. Now, upon closer investigation, you actually can see in his face just when he felt it. Everything's fine. However, at the release, trying to catch her, look at his face right there. Again, we didn't know that there was a problem after the competition, but this afternoon in practice, it was very evident that there was a problem. The side-by-side -side jumps, well, no problem, but a basic lift like this told the story. He couldn't lift her. So they will not be competing in the competition, but on a positive note, I can't wait to see what's going to happen to Kazakova and Dmitriev. They're really exceptional, and once again, they're coached by Tamara Mostvina. Good things, Vern. Okay, Peter, the Paris Championship will be determined tonight, and a little later in the evening, we'll have the Lady Short program. As we said, Michelle Kwan going head-to-head -head against Nicole Bobek. Darren Kagan is with Nicole. Thanks, Vern. Skating fans did indeed have a chance to see Nicole Bobek at Nationals, but because of a bad ankle, she had to pull out after the short program. Nicole, going into this performance, how can you tell us how your ankle's feeling? Um, it's still a little bit sore. I have new boots, and we're having a little problem with them, so my balance is a little bit off, but we're trying to basically live through it and try to get through the program, basically. So is the problem more the boots or the ankle? A um, little bit of the boots, actually. So it's all right. <laughs> You'll just deal with it right now. Um, right now, would you say you're 100% or what percentage would you say you are? Um, mentally, I think 100%. Physically, a little 60%, but I think I'll be able to do all right tonight. Also at Nationals, that was billed as the big showdown between you and Michelle Kwan, and that didn't turn out to be that way, so that's kind of turned into this competition. Do you see this as a showdown, and how do you size up Michelle and the rest of the competition? Um, at this point, it... I really don't care, you know, how they do. I really just care about me getting through the program and doing well and skating good for myself, basically. Just to get through it. Okay, Nicole, good luck tonight. Thanks. 